السلام علیکم ورحمۃ اللہ وبرکاتہ گڈ مارننگ ٹو ون اینڈ آل لیس کنٹینیو دا لاسٹ پارٹ آف دا سیم لیسن دا نیکلس اسٹوری آف فرانس وی ہیڈ کم آن ٹو دا پارٹ دیٹ وے مسز لائسل ہیڈ بلیمڈ میڈم فارسٹر اور مسز فارسٹر دیٹ بیکاز آف مسز فارسٹر ہر ڈیزاسٹرس لائف ہر مزری لائف ہیز اسٹارٹیڈ because she had to pay 36,000 francs for that lost necklace. Now the reaction of Mrs. Forrester was, Me? How can that be? That means obviously Mrs. Forrester says, Why should you blame me? What did I to do to you? Why are you blaming me for that lost necklace? You remember that diamond necklace that you lent to me to wear to the ministry party? Madam Loisel is talking to Madam Forrester that she had borrowed a necklace and borrowed it from Mrs. Forrester in that case and for the ministry's party. Yes, well, well I lost it. What do you mean? You brought it back? Now the discussion was like Madam Forrester and Madam Loisel were talking to each other over the lost necklace. But the necklace was actually lost and it was replaced with a replica of it or a duplicate or a same alike of the same necklace. Madam Forrester says, what do you mean by that? You lost it. You had returned the same necklace to me back again. But then Madam Loisel is saying, I brought you back another exactly like it that means it was not the same ne necklace but it was a replica of the necklace that was lost and it has taken us 10 years to pay for it that means this whole history geography biography of that necklace has paid 10 years of life or 10 years span to pay the complete debts of all the money of 36,000 to be repaid to the people that have been borrowed the amount. But at last it is over and I am very glad. That means now the 10 years have the span has gone and I have paid all my debts up and I am very glad, I am very happy now that I have nothing, no headaches, no brain work, no heavy shoulders on my head so that I can have to wait for something to come on to me, nothing of that sort. Madam Forrester was stunned. Gian, Madam Gian Forrester was stunned. Stunned means out here, totally surprised, totally confused, totally puzzled. You say that you bought a diamond necklace to replace mine? Obviously, in a surprise manner, Madam Forrester is saying, did you replace a diamond necklace to me? But for what? When I gave you a necklace, you replaced to me a diamond necklace? Yes, replied Madame Loisel. Yes, you didn't notice it, you didn't recognize it, you did not see the difference or it, were, or it was more or less a similar one in that case. They were very much similar. They were very much similar, I mean they were much alike the oh, the necklace that you had given and she smiled with a proud and innocent pleasure after saying that she said with a good smile on her face with a happiness on her face but what happened now the real climax opens up madam forrester catches Madame Loisel's hand, both her hands, one hand and then the second hand, hand in hand. Madame Forrester deeply moved, took both her hands. Madame Forrester deeply moved and obviously she thought over the same thing that the necklace costed her 36,000 francs and 10 years of her span of life was also destroyed or disastered or dis miserable in that manner. Oh, my poor Matilda, mine was an imitation. 
that means madam forester holding both hands of madam loisel telling her oh poor matilda my dear child mine was an imitation mine meaning the necklace that i had given to you was a fake necklace was a false necklace was an imitation was a copy of an original one you have spent 36000 to return to me an original necklace of diamond but the one that i had given to you was just simply worth 500 francs at the most that means the necklace was not more than 500 francs in that case now what could have happened madam forester could have done something or uh, madam loisel could have asked for something in so and such a manner now if you think over the story if you think that what could have been happened if if madam loisel had told the spoken the truth at the time when she had lost the real necklace she would have first and foremost thing she would have not lost at 10 years of span of time her luxury life her comfort life all would have been under control and no debts no problems they would not have to shift to a small garret or a small room in to on top of a house in that case and all the miserable miseries that she had faced all over the years of 10 years she would have not have to face all these things but now the table is turned around what should be done the important thing is that two ways either Mad, uh, madam loisel should have spoken the truth and should have saved her 10 years now that 10 years of life have been spoiled or destroyed or dilapidated or ruined in now in the here what can be done now if there is honesty yet living in the world madam forester should return the original original diamond necklace to madam matilde and then again the necklace should be replaced with a false or a fake or a for imitated necklace in that case which should be costing at the most 500 francs not more than that it can be the story could be having a different lineup also in that way and such a thing could be changed in different manners different ways it's up to you how to understand it how to wake walk and talk about in life and take the understanding in such a way any doubt any query any problem anything you've not understood you are most welcome to talk to me to chat with me i am available 24 by 7 you can give me a miss call also and please remember to subscribe share and like the channel so that everyone can have a good view of it and listen and see enjoy the video we are ready to work for everyone as and when it is to be taken over thank you jazakallah